What's up guys? Welcome back to Skookum Living. Today we're going to be building a porch swing. Last fall a big spruce tree fell on a buddy of mine's van to enact my revenge on said tree. I milled it all up into a bunch of big fat planks. So we're going to be using one of those planks, making a back, making a seat, and suspending it from the roof here. Let's just go into the workshop and get right into it. So it's been drying under the house for about five months now. So it's pretty dry. It'll be nice and sandable, so we'll get it all cleaned up, get some measurements, build ourselves a bench. Cool. We got the bottom and the back cut. Now we got to cut the armrest, which is actually the supports that holds the bottom to the back. So first off, gonna cut a straight line, and then I'm gonna make 100 to 110. So I think I'll probably do 107. Sounds like a good angle to me. Which should be about the ideal angle between the seat and the backrest for a human spinal curvature. I don't know, 107 degrees, yeah. Measuring out 107, and that would only be 97. That would be 100. 105. Yeah, let's do a lounger. Let's do a lounger. Boom, backrest. Another piece. Time to sand it all. That was a lot of sanding. But we have all of our pieces, we have our bottom, we have our Armrest, the top of the armrest, and the back. Time to screw in the bottoms. Armrest in 
bound. Ooh Screwing. Here we are. Finish it off with a little sanding. Get in there. I want the rope to actually add some structure to holding the whole bench together. So I'm gonna put a hole right here. So the rope has to go through this armrest and the bottom and the back and so it'll hold everything together. That's a lovely view and a lovely bench. Hit that like button if you guys enjoyed this video. Consider subscribing and I hope to see you guys in the next video.